I give you a hint. He's Italian. That's right. Cross Colombo. Da 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 da. Yeah, the boy. When is this? Some show. No, last night I read. You know, he's in a wheelchair, beautiful, blonde. She's afraid her husband wants to kill her. Wait. I thought you said you didn't watch. Well, the husband usually chooses point. He takes the case. And they got this scene where I eating is the most important thing in the life of a cat. Eating is the most important thing in the life of a cat. I see. <laughs> Wrap it up. <laughs> to go. <laughs> this way. Who cares? You see that? Capitalist bastard. What if it had been a Volkswagen? Nazi bastard. I know, Jacob. I mean, if it was putting up a fancy parking lot. Capitalist bastards. They blow up the cesspool. You want, you can move in with me. But I think we'd end up hating each other. You know, I could be a real pain in the ass. I lived with my wife for 40. Que pasa, tanto? All right, we'll be home in a minute. Patient that I need. See me here, you guy. Yeah. I was much. White boy, black boy. What? Right. A fella I knew up in Harlem. A little cream for Tonto. I'll be up by and by. Gracias. Hasta la vista. Adios. Good morning, Mrs. R. Good morning, Mr. C. Saved the wife's life. Wasn't that something? I almost had a heart attack. And they say that... Who's this, Tonto? That's right. with energy. Oh, today is still bristling. But without the energy, there were trolleys, Tonto. Cobblestones. The aroma of corned beef and cabbage, Tonto. Cars like Rio. And we had paper routes in those days. Get them up early in the morning. You know, people. That's home.
exhausted all your legal means. Not my moral means, not... The mugger! The mugger! That bird! I've been thinking about Lear these past few weeks. I, I'm listening, Pop. What did I say? Do you say... What happened to him? What they did to him? They foreclosed. tonight to go get some sleep. in the fields. When did you last have a woman, Jacob? What? It was about 10 o'clock at night. Huh. You have a wonderful memory. Your piss would freeze before it hit the ground. <laughs> yeah. My father started slipping into her regularly. Polish logic. He was a capitalist bastard. <laughs> we are in like paradise. Maybe it's a good thing. Yeah. 
while panics the war. <laughs> yeah. But then I got afraid it wouldn't turn out all right. That's fine. Come on. Oh, pig's knuckle. I got pig knuckles running out of my ears. My mother makes them every night. Leroy is living with his mother temporarily. That's wonderful. Yeah. I'm going downtown the main office tomorrow. What about welfare? My mother... Leroy wants a place of his own. Doesn't make any difference how old a man is. He needs his privacy. A stupid remark, Elaine. It's not a stupid remark, Bert. Elaine's just being honest about it. I'm going to be dead by this time. Oh. Cook, I'll find a place of my own this week. No, I don't see the mail pouring in from Chicago or Los Angeles. Elaine, will you shut up? With you. A little small, isn't it? Oh, that's to clean. What do you want a big place for? You're not me. <laughs> I could get along on just toasted tea. As long as I have my chocolate bars. My husband, three times. Every time I call, they say, he'll pull through, but they never tell me when he's coming home. I never miss him when he's home. I miss him a lot when he's in the hospital. If he were here, I'd have someone to argue with. I'd find him a nice piece of meat. I have a pet. Huh? Ah, uh, it's freezing in Chicago. I want to see her. Son. Pop? How is she? She sounded fine. I uh, just double park, Bert. I'll do this myself. Bob, at least. Let me. I want you to enjoy yourself. 
Bert, I have enough money. No, nobody's going to touch you. You're just looking for time, Bob. Hey, mister, don't even joke like that. We'll examine every parcel that is hand carried. Well, this parcel contains what? Where can I get a bus to Chicago? At the bus station. How much does it cost to go to the bus station? About ten bucks. It's a deal. Leave it. Time was when I could go into a town. X. See what I mean? People don't know cats anymore. A Rex is a 20 pounder. Jeez, it must cost an arm and a leg to feed that thing. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, you can't talk to the driver while the bus is in motion. Uh, my cat has to relieve himself. You're not supposed to have any animals on a vehicle. But this is an animal, and he's on this vehicle, and he has to go. How did you get that cat on this bus? I carried him on. Better stop this bus, or my cat is going to do his business on somebody's leg. Okay. Hurry it up, kiddo. Hurry up. Come on. Dino! 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 Reclining seats that works. And I guarantee I never would have believed it. I am six I get such terrible headaches. It's right through my skull and bone, bone. There. Now uh now here we're talking about an automatic transmission. Let's call it 250, including tax and license. Soul America. <laughs> Hello? I can hear you now. No, well, let me speak to Bert. Okay. $50. I don't know what year. The, the, it's a good, safe car. Yeah. Huh? A license? That was that. Kids, family, work. Wasn't Annie's fault, though. Oh, we had good times. But you know, maybe... Maybe I thought there just wasn't enough time. Or enough money. 
Lake Saranac, Cape Cod, powerful strokes. They could churn through the water that way. Wonderful. The suffering was worse than the dying. Never complain. Never really feel somebody's suffering. You only feel a like normal kid. James, the son of Alpheus, pound of the Samaritans, would go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel, preaching as you go, saying the king... Heading south towards Atlanta, so I'll be on my way. What about Chicago? Thank you, Mr. Combs. We only met the lift before yours. I saw him on TV. Ginger, can I come home? Yeah. You know where you're going? Sixteen. Sixteen. Yeah. Well, I guess I don't know what it's like to be sixteen these days. Neither do I. Performing has a lot to do with being a good teacher, you know. Embarrassed. I'm sorry. I'm dressed now. Yes, I'm mother. Did you like her? Like her? Loved her. She didn't want to marry me. She didn't believe in marriage. Neither do I. She was a liberated woman long before it became fashionable. Not just sexually liberated. In every way. She danced with Isidore. Isidore Duncan. I saw the movie with Vanessa Redgrave. I went with Jesse for two months. I didn't go into show business. You ever hear from Jesse? Matter of fact, I did. After Isadora died... Her scarf got caught in the car wheel. <laughs> I know, I know. She came back to the States. We got married. Became a housewife. Married a druggist from Fort Wayne, Indiana. It's far out of our way. So what? I see. What are you looking for Jesse for? They used to be sweethearts. Oh, amazing. <laughs> <laughs> a long time ago. <laughs> you better believe it. <laughs> <laughs> Jessie Stone. Oh, well, she hasn't had any visitors in a long time. You know her well? Well, I haven't seen her in 50 years. This is our arts and crafts room. Very nice. Yeah, we like it. Yeah, let's go this way. Yeah. There's Jessie. Where in the 
hell are you going to get me another book? Forget it. From New York. Oh, yes, the professor. No, oh, I didn't get that far. So nice to see you, Jesse. speaks. Norman was silent. You brought my old man, huh? You're looking good, Shirley. You look pretty good to faces. Well, we met on the road. We had a short but passionate love affair. What do you mean? She ran away from home. How old are you? Don't worry about it. I'm leaving in the morning. Where to? Boulder, Colorado? Or maybe Bangladesh? I'd like to take a nice hot bath. I'm sorry, of course. Listen, I live right in the back up there. Up the stairs. Billy, I'll be back. I'm... Oh, Harry, what the hell do you know about communes? Or Shout at me, Shirley. Well, I, I, she'll be knocked up in a week. Ginger's... Well, I don't know. I loved her most, sought to set my rest on her kind nursery. Please, Harry, no Shakespeare, huh? What's the matter with Shakespeare? Probably the world's greatest writer. I know, I agree. I'm tired. It's like something. Oh, no thanks. I've had three years of it already. Why don't I get us some fried chicken? You're eating, too. I'll go with you. Okay. okay. I like you, Norman. What can I do? Teach! What do you think? Whoa. Oh, bullshit. Come on. I'll tell you something, Harry. I don't always like you. But I... I do love you. The strangest thing about being old is... All your friends are dead. It's an idea. How do you do? You think we'll ever stop arguing? Good, Ma. Teen. Yeah, just, 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 just a second. I want you to meet my father. <coughs> it's me again. Yeah. Hang on with him. Well, what would I do in a commune? 
Norman, do you have any change? Hold it. Yes. Uh, Bert, I'll talk quickly now. Uh, Elaine, would you stop crying? Be cool. You promise me? Okay. cats. Had a nice little business on the side. Yeah, Persian, Maltese, Burmese, Mank, beef selling cats. A better does. And good for your sex. I want you to get plenty of C, too. C goes good with E. Except have a good blender. I, I can sell you one. Equal portions of sunflower seeds and honey, and you'd be clean as a whistle. How's that, Harry? Read an article in the paper about catching sharks. Sharks good for a lot of things. Got a job. Wife thought it was a bomb. Told me to. Buried three of them. Good. Going to Vegas. Oh, that'd be just Get this. I've been standing here for about about three quarters of an hour. Oh. Oh. My name is Harry Coombs. Tonto. Hi, Tonto. You got a cigarette, Harry? Uh, I don't smoke. What are you staring at? This Actress? I'm a hooker. You're much too beautiful. I'm a... When's the last time you made it, Harry? Or enjoyed? <laughs> What's the difference? Wake up, Harry. Come on. Thank you. 
Who do you went for? Oh, see. Bad medicine on bad people. You can actually make sick people well? Looks like a demonstration, Mark. Yeah, I make sick people well. Can you cure bursitis? I cure anything. What is bursitis? Uh, it's a pain. Uh, Take off your jacket. Take off your jacket. That looks like my size. Fine, fine. Take what you want. I'll take a pair, but after I cure you. Anything you say. Sit down. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. jacuzzi, a rub down. Yeah, what are you talking about? It's free. It comes with a rent. Yeah. Oh, Peter. I know what you mean. Yeah. <laughs> Session this weekend. It's a great way to get laid. Huh? It's a great way to get laid, Bob. They're on the table, Bob. <laughs> Yeah, they got a whole time, though. <laughs> um, I figured we could stay in this place at first, Pop. The couches, they pull out. And then if it gets too crowded, we could get a one bedroom. That goes for two and a half. View here, ready? Remember? Yeah. Hey. Good morning, Anatole. Good morning. Good morning, Anatole. I I don't accept any of that. Life is a river, life is a fountain routine. Uh, perhaps philosophically it makes sense. But man has to... Boogie won't drown. What about the man in Cleveland, Ohio? Uh, Santa Monica, California. It's all the same. I have a shot. Same, nothing would be different. Nothing is different. Am I different than you are? Only your appearance underneath were all the same. Bullshit. <laughs> Harry, I know you. Uh, are you saying that the air here is the same as the air in town? <laughs> That's crazy. You drive to town. You can't want to those look so good. Roman in the gloaming. On the bunny 
Seed bank supply. Roman woman. Oh, that Tonto. Right. Shine. Um, <laughs> oh, they expect me every day, rain or shine. Oh, 